The Silent Hill film is, without question, a terrible video game movie. I mean, acting is bad, storytelling is not top notch, and this movie is pretty much a boring fest. And not just that, I'm really not a fan of Silent Hill games, so I look at this as another crappy adaptation of the video game. Directed by Christoph Gans, this 2006 horror film is based off the popular video game franchise. It follows a mother and her daughter Rose and Alyssa as they get stranded in the other realm known as Silent Hill. And from there, they have to survive these creatures. And obviously Rose had to find her daughter Alyssa. And the entire movie is just boring. I don't know why a lot of people thought this is a highly good film. I thought the film was pretty bland. I mean, the actor from Radha Mitchell, Sean Bean, Lori Holden, Jody Furlan, I thought that was all pretty poor. I mean, they completely wasted Sean Bean's character. He didn't do anything in the film but try to find his wife and his daughter. But I have to say that at least some of the visuals are interesting to look at. The creature designs are, are ripped straight from the video game. Even though I said I'm not a big fan of games, I have played like earlier, the earlier installments, obviously, of the video game. So I see what they was going for. They were trying to go for a horror S5, obviously, like the video game. But to me, it just fell flat. I mean, I didn't really care that much about the characters. And uh, acting is not great either. If anything, this is not the worst video game movie I've seen. I've seen worse. But this film obviously could have been better for what it is. But nonetheless, though, if you're a fan of the video games, and if you've seen this film, you probably like this movie. But this is not the worst video game film out there, honestly enough. There are worse video games out there. But I kind of felt like there was a lot of key... There was a, what I'm trying to say is there was key components missing in this story. And what I mean by missing components, there are still plot holes in this film. This movie don't focus enough on the creatures and the origins of it, but then again, did the early games ever did. And there's a lack of direction here. Sure, there's a goal of Rose trying to find her daughter Alyssa, but other than that, she comes across this cult-like group. And... That's pretty much it. After the cult lock group is dealt with, the movie just ends. I mean, this is not a horrible video game movie, but it's still pretty bad. I was interested in certain spots, but not enough to say, oh, this is a good adaptation of the video games. I think the Sound Hill video games have done the story a lot better, considering how those were just simple adventures where a character had to go to point A, point B. And this, not so much. I feel like it was a waste of time. Plus, Lori Holden plays a cop in this film, Sylvie, and she's not great. She's mediocre, to say the least. If anything, I felt like maybe they would polish the script. This could have been a very good video game movie. I'm giving this movie a 6 out of 10. Not awful but it's still bad in my opinion there are some interesting moments throughout the film such as the interaction between Sylvie and Rose obviously Rose found her daughter and then doing whatever it takes to save her daughter but the film ends on a particular interesting note they're still trapped in Silent Hill so they never made it home and not just that though this movie's not really scary it has some intense moments, but that's all it is. If you're a fan of this film, that's great, but I always thought this was a weak video game movie. And that's my review of the film Silent Hill. Okay, leave your comments down below in this section and let me know what you think about this movie. Do you like this film? Do you hate it? Do you think it's better than the video games? Or are the video games better than this film in your opinion? Alright, stay tuned. More movie reviews coming up. Alright, this is Slim Guy 172 saying, Peace out.